This program will demonstrate how to install a rescue PVC spill containment system for battery rooms. To properly install rescue containment systems, you will need hacksaw or miter saw, electric hammer drill with 5 16 inch nut driver, chalk line reel, straight edge, tape measure, a utility knife, and a caulk gun. All rescue containment systems will include corners, rails, liner, liner clips, patch kit, pilot bit, concrete fasteners, rescue absorbent pillows, and silicone adhesive. Step 1. Measuring for containment system. Begin by measuring the length and width of the battery rack system that will go inside the containment system. Mark the footprint of the rack's intended location on the floor. The footprint is the outermost part of the rack, not necessarily the feet or base plates. Mark the outer perimeter of the rack and increase it by 2 inches in all directions. Mark the new perimeter using chalk line reel. Mark the rack center on all four sides using a chalk line reel. Allow chalk line to extend past the perimeter by at least 8 inches. Step 2. Laying down the PVC liner. Lay the PVC liner in position. Make certain you have a minimum of 6 inches of overrun liner outside the marked perimeter. Mark the center of the liner with a chalk line reel. Remove the PVC liner to begin forming the containment box. Step 3. Forming the containment box. Position the PVC corners with the short side facing the floor and facing inward. With electric hammer drill and masonry bit provided, drill pilot holes and anchor the corners to the floor with fasteners. Position the rails between the corners. Cut PVC rails with miter saw if necessary for a snug fit. Anchor rails to floor using fasteners. Once the containment box is formed, seal the joints with silicone adhesive. Step 4. Folding liner into box. Lay the PVC liner back into position using chalk lines. Fold one long side of the liner to the inside of the rail, allowing at least 2 inches to overlap on the outside. Fold liner at a 45 degree angle at the corner, making sure that all the edges of the liner fold over the spill containment system. Place clips over the rails, holding the liner up over the containment walls. Repeat this process on the opposite side of the containment system. Finally, fold the liner and place clips over the rails on the remaining sides. Trim excess liner using utility knife. Step 5. Installation of battery racks. Once the corners, rails, liner, and clips have been assembled, carefully place the battery rack onto the containment system and attach according to the manufacturer's specifications. Seal the edges of the battery rack and bolts with silicone adhesive. Step 6. Installation of pillows and socks. After batteries are placed in the battery rack, add absorbent pillows and socks. Rescue absorbent pillows are 12 inches square in size. Within the spill containment system, place the pillows in close proximity to each other, overlapping if necessary. For more videos on rescue spill containment systems, visit quickhowto.com.